Come on in. My name is Bill Tobin and this is your restaurant success tip of the day. I think the first time that I heard of Yelp was when somebody pointed out to me that we had a bad review online. And looking at the site, I saw that though we did have one bad review, there were a couple dozen four or five star reviews, so I was content to leave it alone. That was in mid-2007. But by the end of 2007, I was learning to hate Yelp and TripAdvisor and all the other wannabe online review sites. Though we got plenty of great reviews, the occasional one star review was like a knife in the gut. It was painful. I became obsessed with checking reviews throughout the day. It was torture. I would talk to other restaurateurs and they were equal, equally distraught. But as I continued to read the reviews, I started to recognize patterns. Some people didn't like certain menu items. Hosts some were sometimes rude. Drinks didn't taste right. I addressed these items and our staff and the reviews started changing. I continued to watch the reviews and realized that most of the reviews were giving us valuable feedback. Instead of hating the review sites, I saw that they were a tool to help us improve. Now, 13 years later, and with almost 4,000 reviews, we make it a regular policy to share both good and bad reviews with staff, celebrating good reviews and using the bad reviews to get better. Yes, it still hurts to get a bad review, but now I see it as a chance for us to grow. So your task for today, review your online reviews with your staff to complement them and to find ways to get better. Now go make it happen. Do you have a comment or a tip for restaurant leaders? Text me at 808-201-0550 or find me at restaurantleadership365.com. This is Bill Tobin. Thanks for coming in. See you tomorrow.